Help support our coverage with a free account on Privacy, the service that keeps you protected when shopping online. Get $5 to try it now by using promo code QZZ2J. And with Blueberry, the community that gives creators the power to make money, get detailed audience measurements, and host their audio and video. Get a 30-day free trial by using promo code BLUEBERRY004. Our next guest is here. Hello. Hello. How are you doing today? Uh, it's been a good day so far. How about you guys? It's Going been great. a day. Yeah. <laughs> great. Thanks for joining us, Nathan. <laughs> Thank you. So go ahead and introduce yourself for us. Uh, my name is Nathan Hart. I am Chief Sales Officer for a company called Innovelli. Okay. And uh, we've got some LED strips here on yeah. the table in front of us. So tell me about what we're looking at. So I was asked to bring some show and tell products. Yes. Um, and, and I'm going to start with our some of our newest stuff. Um, so we are a Z-Wave brand, in case you didn't know that. Um, our, we can be found over in booth 41917 in the Z-Wave booth area. Uh, but that, this is our light strip. Uh, the nice thing about this light strip, it comes in one foot increments. Um, so one of the things people have been complaining about is you buy a six, meet, a six foot light strip, you cut two feet off, you throw the rest away. Uh -huh. yep. With ours, you don't do that. Um, you can actually use some of these connectors we have. So like that a 90 was degree connector. Just, that's awesome. Done and done. And then you can connect, wrap around a yep. TV, wrap around a wall. And what I love about this, in my industry, I'm a corporate AV technician, uh, we use this kind of stuff for lighting all the time. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you how many times I've had to sit down in a warehouse and hand solder mm -hmm. LED strips yeah. together to to make something that lights a frame that's 60 feet wide, 30 feet high. Right. Done. Yeah. Right there. Just so y'all can see it. Like, that's finished. Yeah, that's great. No, no need for soldering. No need for trying to figure that no, out. Done. Get the wiring right. Yep. You know, Comes make with a T-shaped adapter as well. So you can connect, do whatever you need to do. Um, the controller that controls everything, I didn't have it with me, but yeah. um, you can run, uh, it'll come pre-programmed with 50 different scenes on there, chase scene, okay. you know, I mean, yeah. it'll mimic fire. Each LED about this is individually, individually addressable. Okay. Okay. Uh, so so it's, a, it's essentially a pixel strip. Correct. Yeah. Okay. It's RGBTW. Um, so, and each one you can control the speed, temperature, you can control the brightness or the color right from and individually. So this is DMX controllable, all that kind of stuff then, since you can address everything. Correct, yeah. Wow. That is, that's phenomenal. That is absolutely amazing. Totally applicable to my industry. I say, and it brings us back to what turned out to be an accidental lead-in conversation. Yeah, yeah. As you were sitting down, we were talking about how this city is so tech, and it makes sense because since it, stopped being a mob city, it has always been on the, the leading edge, almost the bleeding edge of sign technology, right. lighting and screens and stuff like that. This city has run that industry, and the things you could do with this, because you know, you've got pixels so close together, being able to control them with that, with that you know, fidelity. Right. Gives yeah, you I mean, all there's kinds of 24 capabilities. LEDs a foot on those. I mean, yeah. it, it can get very bright. It has that capability. It's very flexible. That, it's, that's it's, what I was going to say. The flexibility of mm -hmm. this, a lot of them are very metallic on the backside. You go to move it, and it bends, stays yeah. at the stays angle. Stays in place. It's got, it's got that which, memory of the plastic and the copper. depending on what you're doing, might sure. be what you want. You yeah. might want to be able to bend it, and, but most of the time you want to... Yeah. Use the right. 3M tape on the yeah, back and adhere it. Stick it on, and, <laughs> and then away you go. Yeah. So uh, when these chip, uh, these will actually, the back side of the connectors, everything will come with 3M tape. So okay. things will be sticky. It will, it will be able to uh, actually adhere to something. Yeah. So You know, an important part of a, yeah, a sticky thing is to be able important. to stick it to things. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you'd be surprised how often that doesn't happen. Though. Oh, I yep. No, yeah. I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, well aware. <laughs> I have I've been doing a lot of reviews on LED strips okay. lately from uh, from a number of companies, and uh, no, doesn't surprise me at all anymore. Yeah, nothing yeah. can surprise and me. I well, hey, when you get some time, pop over to the booth. We'll show you uh, this yeah. thing in action. We've got a working model over there. So. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. I, I mean, just uh, the ease of connection of this is is just so great. Yeah, it just the, pops the, right on. The modular modular. Yeah, nature of it is is fantastic. We um, 
we used to work with a, a TEDx uh, licensee in Tampa. Okay. And we were building a backdrop for one of our events using uh, LED pixels, the individually addressable pixels. Yeah. Didn't and what a pain work. that was to put together. Mm -hmm. It took forever to, in, you know, using we used pegboard and we popped the pixels in yeah. one at a time and then we had to create wiring between it and power it and yeah. I could take this and stick it in a grid <laughs> and be done. Yeah. yeah. That would have saved so much time. Yeah, precisely never for finished it. <laughs> for lighting the back of stages, set pieces, all that kind of stuff. You could make all kinds of patterns with these connectors. Yeah. yeah, it's fantastic. Now, what is cool. what is the power consumption of this? How many strips can you put together before you need to put a repeater in? Anything like that? Sure, you're looking to be able to connect approximately 30, uh, 30 strips before you're you'll have to add inline inline power to that. Okay, so uh, every we do intend on coming out with inline power capabilities. So. All right, so about every thirty feet, not yeah. bad, not bad. Yeah, yeah, I think some of it is just the individual addressable part. Uh, All right. Just yes, I'm and guessing. Listen, I'm the sales guy, guys. So, <laughs> not, uh, the, the, the technical the Dale, stuff, the, the Dale's the, guy. The yeah, Dale's that's okay. Office. The Sorry. technical stuff. It's not that I don't understand some of it, but uh, that's why we have a, a CTO. Just, just kind of gives really you the shark it. eye roll, like uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> brain overload. <laughs> so. And you, yeah, did you really just ask that? <laughs> Yeah, I understand. <laughs> um, yeah. So you brought another product with you as well. I did. Couple Tell us a little bit about this one right here, the Illumin. Here is our Z-Wave RGBW light bulb. Uh, it's our Illumin brand. And it's a sub-brand of Innovelli. Uh, really, the, the big thing with these, we're trying to come out with a, a quality Z-Wave piece, um, something that is able to be used in your home. You, you can pair this with direct association to our dimmer switch. <laughs> And you'll be able to dim the smart bulb in real time, which is a big oh. deal. Most of the time now, you're not able to actually, you hear smart switch or smart bulb. Yep. Um, usually they don't play nice together. Well, because at Z-Wave, we're able to actually do that. And so let's, r real quick, uh, Z-Wave, for those who may not know, uh, is, sure. an, is an alliance of companies that use a single standard to be able to communicate so that there's no... no uh, conflicts or no anything cross like that talk. and right. you can use them with each other without having to have hubs and things like that yes. the idea is that you know this switch that z waves back here this, <laughs> this switch could control uh something that's not a light product correct <laughs> something unrelated or uh, a security center could turn the lights yeah. on yeah it's all easy within to set, the alliance um, you know a routine or a scene you know you have a google routine or alexa routine um, I want to go to bed. I need to set my lights to a certain, yep. I want them off. I want my thermostat to a certain temperature. I want to make sure my doors are locked. Yeah. A simple double press down on the switch will allow you to, to run that routine, and, and you don't have to worry about it. It's right. much easier to do that way. Right, and, and maybe you even want it to change your thermostat and things like that, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, and all exactly. of that because a Z-Wave is possible. Right. And yeah, I love that. I, if you can't tell, I'm a big Z-Wave fan. We uh, last year Danielle and I walked the entire pavilion, and we did an interview at each, each and every little stall right. in the pavilion. So, and one of my favorite things about this aluminum pro uh, alumin product here is the construction of it. Yeah. Uh, I've had numerous color change bulbs in my home studio. Uh, just for fun, that, while I'm recording things like that, questionable. They feel <laughs> utterly, utterly light. Like they weigh as much as a normal light bulb, yeah. which is disturbing to me with actual electronics and circuits in there, and especially the fins on them. They always tend to fall off. They get all janky, right. and this doesn't have any of that. No, it's it's one solid piece. It is. It's got weight to it. You know, it's, it actually feels right. like a product. Yeah. Um, I, I did want to hit on the switch a little bit. Sure. It is our, our bread and butter. So some big things about this uh, 500 series Z-Wave. Um, camera over here. Not that camera. <coughs> yeah, no worries. 500 series Z-Wave switch here that I had upside down. Uh, <laughs> it happens. It, so this, this thing offers scene control. This is our red series line. We offer a red series and black series. Major difference in the red series you're going to have scene control. You'll have the ability to do notifications and energy monitoring built into this product. 
So notifications, I leave my garage door open past 9 p.m. This, this switch has the capability to just blink red or blink blue, whatever you what? program it to do. Nice. Uh, the other big selling feature of this switch, it, it is non-neutral compatible. You don't have to use a neutral wire to make this work, even in a three or four way scenario. Wow. Um, so we've really taken it to a new level. We've, yeah. We've pushed it beyond what a normal smart switch is capable to do in some of those scenarios. Yeah. And it's it, the ability to have that kind of control over your home. People are absolutely loving it. Yeah. And uh, the one thing I like is right here, the little QR code. Yeah. If I don't know if you can see that or not. But is that to be able to actively get the app and stuff like that it to is. control everything? So, uh, Z-Wave offers S2 encryption, which is a high-profile high security, mm -hmm. and Smart Start. So what you're seeing there is Smart Start. Uh, it's just an easy way to include products to your hub, okay. uh, whatever hub that you end up using. It just makes connection simpler. Very yeah. cool. And so what's our availability on these products? Uh, so right now, you're able to pick up the all our, our switches, specifically this Red Series dimmer switch. You can pick up the Illumin RGBW bulb um, right now. Uh, those okay. products are available today. You can buy those at innovelli.com or right off Amazon. Okay. So uh, our two box products. The two box products. Um, the other light strip feature here, uh, this hardware is 90 is 100% complete. Firmware, 90% complete. Okay. Uh, it, okay. Just, it just takes some time to program 50 scenes on these Yeah, it, yes, well, so. and <laughs> not just that, but the fact that it's going to be DMX controllable, that it's an actual mm. pixel strip. That means I love you that. Could, that means that you could, like, run video through it. All Indeed. kinds of stuff. Like That's so many applications. I am so excited. Uh, when are you looking at a release date for that? Because I want that like 85 times yeah. on my wish list. Uh, so right now, we're as we're wrapping it up, we're hoping to have it out possibly Q2, probably Q3 this year. Wow. So, okay. Quick uh, launch then. It's quick. Uh, we started this project back in... Uh, early Q4, late Q3. Um, so we're just kind of getting it going. We, we had this idea like, hey, uh, the CEO, Eric Hines, and I, we were sitting at breakfast and thought, why do people need to keep wasting money on light strips, throwing I've, them away? I've literally <clears throat> thrown away about yeah. six feet of light strip lately just because I don't want to go and solder the stuff together yeah. mm -hmm. yeah. to make so. another strip. And well. this is great. Zero well, waste. I, I look forward to seeing these out on the market because uh, – I want to put them to use. <laughs> yeah, I pixel strip everything in my house. Wonderful. Everything. So yeah, it, it, I can't wait. I'm looking forward to it too. It's our, one of our most requested products. Yeah, so. very There's, cool. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for coming and talking to Thanks, us. Thanks, guys. I appreciate you letting me uh, share a couple Absolutely. minutes. Absolutely. I can't wait to come by and see the rest of the products at the Z Wave booth. Yeah. And so, so. before we let you go, if people want more information, they can get it by? Uh, you go to innovelli.com. It's I N O V E L L I.com. Or you can find all our products available right there on Amazon. All right. Fantastic. Thank you Great. so much. Yeah, can't thanks, wait. Guys. Have thank a good you. Day.